Missouri Governor Mike Parson slammed Planned Parenthood today over its handling of the state's last legal abortion clinic. He accused the clinic of failing to comply with Missouri's Department of Health's requests and claimed that Planned Parenthood had actively violated numerous state laws. Regardless or if you support abortion or not, Planned Parenthood should be able to meet the basic standards of health care under the law. It would be reckless for any judge to grant a temporary restraining order ruling before the state has taken action on a license renewal. No judge should be special treatment to Planned Parenthood in this instance. If you break the law, there are serious consequences. The governor said the clinic in St. Louis will lose its license this Friday if it does not comply with health standards. Planned Parenthood has sued to try and keep the facility open. CBSNews.com reporter Kate Smith has been following the story and she joins me now. So Kate, under what conditions would the state allow this clinic to remain open? The state is asking for full compliance with an investigation that they've uh, looked into in the clinic. So what's going on is they've said that there are certain deficiencies going on in the clinic, but they haven't told the clinic what those deficiencies are specifically. They've given them general areas of where they might be. And they've also required that all seven physicians that have ever worked at the uh, Planned Parenthood for the past year all be interviewed under uh, you by state officials. Mm -hmm. Now the problem with that is that only two of those physicians are actually employees of Planned Parenthood. So Planned Parenthood can't compel those last five to sit for interviews and those last five their counsel has advised them not to sit for these interviews because they don't know the scope of them and they also the state has also said that these interrogations could result in criminal proceedings and or losing their license. Well, is it legal for a state to not have any abortion clinics? And that's a great question, and it's one that Planned Parenthood is really banking on. So in 2014, Louisiana was in a very similar situation, and a judge found that it is not legal for a state to effectively uh, mandate and regulate out abortion out of its state. And so a judge found that. But however, in, Lu in uh, Missouri, uh, excuse me, the judges there have been found to be a little bit more hostile towards abortion access. So they've actually disagreed with Supreme Court findings about what is allowed and what state regulators are allowed to mandate that clinics have. So it's unclear whether or not a federal judge in Missouri could find that. All right. So many people watching this case very closely. Kate Smith. Kate, thank you very much.